With these graph questions, you kind of have two tactics. Um, you can either start with the graph and just try to analyze the answer choices and see which ones are factually true based only on the graph, or you can go to the passage and try to understand the logic of what they're trying to get us to say. Um, the, the accuracy thing won't always work, but it does help us here. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Um, if we look at the graph quickly, we see we have these three regions, there's three different types of crops, and then the, the left side is telling us the, the percentage of, of the farmers that are female for each of those crops in each of those regions. So if we look at choice A, um, most of the farmers who mainly cultivated cereals and most of the farmers who mainly cultivated non-root vegetables in South Ando, South Ando, were women. So South Ando is here. And the cereals and non-root vegetables are going to be the first and last um, bars. So it's true for the non-root vegetables, right? So that number is above 50%. So that's saying that most of those farmers were women. Um, but the first part is wrong, right? So the cereals, it's only 35% of women. So that's not most. Most means 51% or more. Most equals 51% plus, right? So uh, it's just not true, right? It's just not accurate. So I don't care what the passage says. This is just not true based on the graph. B, more women in central Ando, uh, so central Ando, uh, mainly cultivated root crops, that's this middle one, middle one, um, then mainly cultivated cereals. So it, I, most of you are just going to look at that and be like, no, the cereals bar is higher, so that's just wrong. And that's, that's true, like it, it's, it is wrong. Um, but technically it's not wrong for that reason. The, these are percentages. The bars represent percentages. They don't represent the total number, right? So um, it could be that 35% of the, you know, so this is the cereals here, 35% is of a um, much smaller overall number of farmers. So it's, it's a smaller proportion. Uh, it's a big proportion of a small number. Whereas it could be that the roots, the root crops, it's a small proportion of a big number. And that could be a much larger overall number of people. If that's confusing, you don't worry about it. Basically, the short of it is there's a difference between a percentage and a raw value. And so this, this choice is just really convincing those things. We don't know the raw number because we don't have that. We only have a percentage. So the SAT sometimes uses that trap uh, to kind of confuse us. So just be careful of these kind of like percentage traps, what a percent means. Um, C, most of the farmers who mainly cultivated non-root vegetables in North and South Ando, so South, North, non-root is going to be this and this, um, were women. Well, that seems true, right? The, the black bars for North and South Ando are both above 50%. So that seems true. Now, it doesn't mean it's right. I mean, it's possible that D is true as well. So let's take a look. Uh, a relatively equal proportion of women across the three regions of Ando mainly cultivated cereals. So cereals are the first bar. And it's kind of equal. Um, North Ando seems lower. Whether it's equal or not is maybe up to judgment. But I would say for the sake of accuracy, okay, fine. I could see that as being accurate. So the question then is, well, then what does the passage want? Because we have two choices that are potentially uh, correct. So we need to figure out which one matches with the theme of the lines. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to skip to the end here. What are they building towards? In some regions, female farmers were found to be especially prominent in the cultivation of specific types of crops and even constituted the majority of farmers who cultivated those crops. For instance, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Well, choice D is asking about cereals, which in no region is the majority uh, female, right? So those are all about 30, 35%. So that's not a majority. So this has nothing to do with what we're talking about. Whereas choice uh, C is talking about um, women who are, you know, being the majority of these farmers for these crops in these regions. So not only is it accurate, but it is hitting this idea of women being the majority. So um, sometimes we're going to need to do both, to go for the accuracy and to go for the passage. So it's up to you uh, whether you want to start with the accuracy or start with the passage. The, the passage will always work, but it does involve more reading and more thoughts. And so for some of us, going by just the graph might be easier because it lets us kind of declutter the question and focus just on one thing at a time.